This road that comes from the right to the left here is called Bejai Road or Bejai Church Road. And just at this junction where there are a lot of options of shops and restaurants and uh, you know different shopping areas, we've come to Hotel Vaibhava, which is at KSRTC Bus Stand, Mangaluru. It's a pure veg restaurant, and we're going to try the local cuisine here. Let's see how it is. So join us in this journey at Hotel Vaibhava. Mind you. Every restaurant in, uh, or practically every restaurant in India will be called a hotel. So it's not a place to stay, but somehow they call it a hotel. So colloquially called hotel, but it could be a restaurant. So find out before you get in if you intend to stay anyway. We are at KSRTC's bus depot at Mangalore. And Ruben has ordered Medu Vada. Ruben, how is the Medu Vada? And Dula has ordered the regular masala dosa. How is your masala dosa? The dosa is nice and crispy. Huh. And the baki is very tasty. And here comes Walter's ghee roast, which is like a small tent. And I have ordered a puri bhaji. There are only two puris, but each puri size is so big. It actually seems like one, two, three, four, five, six puris. So it's quite big. I'm going to taste and tell you how it is. This is more like the bature type of a puri, and uh, the vegetable they've given is very little. So I've got to cook. Eat very little of the vegetable to match the puri size. And here I am consuming it. Are you moving to Rakhine place? Freshly made puri. The vegetable I think is the same as the one in masala dosa. Very tasty. I only eat it with very little. I have got to eat less vegetables with each morsel of puri. How you love What can you do? Ruben, how is the sambar? Did you taste the sambar dula? Mm. Not that good. Not that good. What the, how's your ghee roast? Have you tried it? Yes, uh, see, this is a very safe bed. So I don't uh, like the butter that uh, potato masala. So just a plain ghee roast. And uh, it's nice and crispy. And uh, the chutney is good. Let me try the sambar. See how the sambar is. I see this is sambar without any vegetables. So, there's not much flavor in the sambar. It's just like a watery sambar. So it's more like a rasam and not a like sambar. A mm. Not even a rasam actually, but there's no flavor in it. Oh, okay. I haven't uh, got any sambar, but I've got a little bit of chutney. I'm going to try that. If coconut chutney is not fresh, never eat. No, you have to be fresh because mm. it's a moving restaurant. Chutney is fresh, tasty, not spicy, very flavorful, a lot of spices in it, but it's not pungent. This is all the KSRTC canteen within the bus depot. You can see the bus depot through the window. All the buses parked there. And this is the main road, a junction right here. And this road is the Bejai Church Road. So it's just at the junction, when you walk from Bejai Church down to KSRTC's depot at Manglo, you will find it here. So we'll tell you the review after we have some filter coffee and tea as well. We're planning to have some Manglo buns, so we'll give you feedback on that as well. Stay tuned. We've ordered the mango buns. They're more like puris. 
with a little fluff in between, but slightly sweet and very very tender and soft. How is it? Very yum, very soft, fresh out of the oven, and it's got that hint of banana and cumin. Even that's it. Ruben, did you try the bun? No. Walter? No, I had it. Did you try Walter? No, I haven't tried the bun. Try the bun and tell us. Here is my tea. And here is the filter coffee that Walter and Dula have ordered. Uh, they do like the taste of the coffee. But I think uh, there's a good amount of chicory in it by the by the aroma I can tell you. The bun, the mango bun. Deep fried, got a nice color on the outside. It's got some spices, you can see some jeera and all in there. And it's uh, probably been put some yeast or something, that's why you can see it's like a little bit fluffy inside. And again, you can see some uh, spice like jeera inside. And uh, it is on the sweeter side, they're called mango buns. They're nice. You can't go wrong with a mango bun. They are delicious and uh, I don't think we get them in Bombay. We find them in Mangalore and uh, I even get them in UAE so I'm very happy that I find them in UAE. We leave from here to an even more crowded, to an even more crowded restaurant at Hotel Vaibhav. And as we walk out, we tell you how the dishes were. The puri baj was excellent, except that uh, the quantity of the vegetable or the bhaji was a little less. The puris were not small, they were more like uh, bhatures, quite large. And they gave us two instead of five, So, but the, but the size compensated for the quantity. Uh, the mango buns were super amazing, the medu vada was nice. The masala dosa was really, really authentic, had a lot of ghee and the ghee roast masala dosa was extremely good. And here they're walking out a little happier than they walked in because the hunger is satiated. They see Ruben is smiling and so is Dula. So a smile means they're happy with the food. Hello. Walter is not so happy. Is he happy? Uh, Harry, it's a no frills restaurant, so you can't say much about it. It's a very busy one, and there's all these people coming for the buses here, interstate buses. They find the meal cheap. Like the breakfast we had, it cost us only 300 dirhams. Sorry, 300 dirhams. rupees. 300 rupees, sorry. <laughs> and uh, it's it's a value for money, I think. Only thing it could be a bit cleaner with the plates all water on it. And I again ordered another filter coffee, and I found the flavor like you know like. Kerala coffee, that is because there was a piece of curry patta in the coffee. So, <laughs> they need to be a little bit clean. So, they tried the to made it, make your filter coffee more organic. Yeah. So, we leave back again, a little uh, walk of about 10 to 15 minutes. Extremely hot and humid in the month of December. I don't know what's, what's wrong with the weather. But I can only tell you this, maybe the weather will turn better. If you like our videos, subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon. You will get a better weather in the next few days. Thank you. Have a wonderful time ahead.